Hey, how's it going today, YouTube? Just wanted to do a quick video on which Canadian coins are silver and which Canadian coins are not silver. Uh, bear in mind that this video is just in reference to circulating coinage. I do realize that the Canadian Mint has produced silver coins since 1968, uh, but I'm not talking about collectible coins here or special issue coins. I'm talking about circulating coinage. 1968 was the last year that the Canadian Mint produced any circulating silver coinage. Um, 1967, they switched halfway through the year to 50% copper, 50% silver coinage. Uh, here we have in front of us 1968 silver quarter. That is 50% silver, 50% copper. We have a 1968 silver dime. Again, that's 50% silver, 50% copper. And then beneath it, we have the quarter and the dime that were produced in the second half of the year, 1968. This quarter is 99.9% .9 nickel, and this dime is 99.9% .9 nickel. These coins are very easy to tell apart which ones are silver and which ones are nickel. All we need to do is take a regular magnet here. Now remember, of course, silver is diamagnetic and nickel is ferromagnetic. So notice that the silver is not attracted to the magnet. And oh, look at that. Nickel coin is attracted to the magnet. So there we go. Easy way to test your coins. If you're wondering if they're silver, obviously if they're silver, they're not going to be attracted to a magnet. Now again, just to clear up any confusion, in case any of you have any doubts um, about uh, which coins are silver and which ones are nickel, here we have a 1968 Canadian half dollar. Again, all of the half dollars in 1968 are made out of pure nickel. And here we have a 1968 Canadian one dollar coin. Again, all 1968 dollar coins are made out of pure nickel. The only silver coins produced in Canada in 1968 were the quarter and the dime. So again, if you want to tell which ones are nickel, they're going to be picked up by the magnet. Obviously, silver being diamagnetic is not going to be picked up by the magnet. 